usually if I'm struggling to identify if something I'm going through like warfare or whatever is um, a test of my patience versus hindrances from the enemy which God can definitely use hindrances from the enemy and use it as a test of your patience um, I have to take into consideration and go back backtrack and ask myself is the thing that this is pertaining to even in the will of God if something is not God's will then the difficulties that you're experiencing with said thing those are walls that God is putting up or rather that God is allowing to be put up to keep you from progressing in this thing with this thing through this thing but if you've already gotten confirmation from God, if you're already at a place where you know that this is his will, whatever that looks like, a place, a situation, an opportunity, a person, a thing, whatever, then any opposition that you are facing can naturally be linked to, okay, this is something that God wants for me, something God has for me. The opposition I'm facing right now is more than likely the enemy trying to oppose what is God's will and God is allowing it as a test of my patience, okay? Sometimes we think that when God blesses a thing or gives his consent for a thing or says this Thing is stamped with his approval that it's not going to come with any difficulty any discomfort any opposition whatsoever and that's not reality in fact if something is God's will it's gonna have a lot more opposition than something that is not God's will and usually when you're in something that is not God's will and you're dealing with opposition it's really God trying to show you hey I already told you this wasn't of me I already gave you red flags I already warned you you didn't listen this is my grace trying to show you this is again not for me and for you to make your way out definitely go back and sit with god ask yourself if the thing that you're referring to um is even in the will of god ask yourself if he said no and you kept you know pushing forward into that thing that's him letting you know go back and if he said yes and you have peace about that then this is obviously something he's using, allowing to grow you, to prune you, to stretch you in the area of your faith and your relationship with him. I also want to add that if you're ever in a position where you're waiting for an answer from God or you're waiting, um, praying for clarity and you're not getting or you feel like you are not able to identify his clear yes, his clear no, either that is a sign that he's calling for you to backtrack and switch up the questions that you're asking him switch up what it is that you are praying for or how it is that you're praying for this thing or okay he may just be calling for you to be patient and wait for the answer to come i look forward to seeing you in my next video bye